Celebrating Ohio Women's Basketball's Senior Day, brought to you by Integrated Services for Behavioral Health. With Gabby Burris, my name's Jay Cremata, and Gabby, time flies, doesn't it? <laughs> yes, and This it is does. crazy. I remember your, uh, your first game from your freshman year. We're gonna get to that. Don't worry, <laughs> oh we're gonna get to it. Um, but I, I, I want to start first with uh, just playing here in general. What, what's it meant to you to represent the green and white? Um, it's definitely, um, spending five years here has definitely given me a lot of different memories and opportunities. I've met a lot of people and playing here definitely um, has meant a lot to me. I don't know how to put it into words. It's given me a whole new perspective on life. What's something that uh, you'll cherish forever after playing here? Um, I'm definitely going to take with me the people that I have met here and all the relationships I built. Um, those are something that's going to stick with me forever and uh, I'm really thankful for everybody that I met and got to play with all the experiences we have and memories we've made on the floor and off the floor. Now, we're going to throw it back a little bit. I want to know if you remember your first game as a Bobcat. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember. You don't remember who you played? It was here. It was in this building. No, I don't. You don't? It was against High Point. Mm -hmm. And you scored 14 points. Now I'm going to give you this. Uh and I want you to watch some of your highlights back. Oh my gosh, this is funny. This is my first game. That was your first game. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah. And I was going through that too, and I'm like, they all look so young. Yes. Every single one of you. Yeah. A com awesome. complete different person, it looks like, <laughs> honestly. And you don't remember that at all? No, I don't. What's the earliest game you can recall? Oh, gosh. I don't know. Like, I just, I don't know. Like, I don't have one. It's kind of like they all like almost mixed together. Like I remember all like big, imp like big plays, or when people talk about like, do you remember when this happened? I'm like, yeah, I do, but I can't, don't know what year it was. <laughs> I'm gonna show you some of your old pictures, and I want you, and I want to get your reaction on your evolution throughout your years here. That is from your freshman year. Oh. You go and swipe right. In your sophomore year. <laughs> and chop the hair off. <laughs> wow. I mean, you see that person now. How much have you grown since that, seeing that first picture and then throughout the years you were able to see that? Oh my gosh. It's, it's so hard to look at a picture and say how much I've grown because it's all inside me, all my mental game and just... I see that one too. <laughs> yeah. Little Fred. I never got one with Faye, but it's okay. Um, I don't... It's, it's crazy because I think about just definitely a mental change. I was a lot more of a act now, or just, I don't know how to say it, have a quicker response to things, and I don't know. I just definitely matured mentally as a person and communicating and just working with individuals and my teammates, so. And I know it's something that you probably don't think about unless somebody like me asks you the question in your senior night interview. So. Yeah. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. Um, I, I do want to ask about the staff really quick. How much has Bob and the staff meant to you over the years? Um, they've definitely been there uh, for me through a lot of things. Uh, they know a lot about me and, um, you know, they're always there to help, whether it's with life, school, or basketball, all of them are always there. The other seniors, CC, Kaylee, Hunter, what's it been like playing alongside them all these years? It's crazy because the classes have changed so much, but it's it's been an amazing experience. All the accomplishments that we've made together and individually to be a part of that is something that I will remember for the rest of my life and I will, that's a story I'm telling my kids or, you know, it's just crazy. It's been a great experience. Uh, building that relationship with them, basketball, and as a friend. Why are you going to miss playing here? I don't know. I'm going to miss playing basketball in general. And I think it's going to be really tough to take that next step. I mean, I haven't stopped playing basketball since I don't, I don't know when. I'm going to miss it all as a whole. This place just gave me the platform to be able to play basketball, and I'm thankful for that. What do you want to say to Bobcat Nation? To the fans, thank you for the support throughout all the years. And to my family, thank you for supporting me through all these years and to the years prior. Thank you for all the fun memories. Thank you.